Guys, how you doing? Uh, welcome to Goodworks Tractors. Today is, is not a tractor video, uh, still related to the business uh, that you guys would have seen through your, your lens and through your screens over the last couple of years. But uh, unfortunately, you know, if you didn't see the post from this weekend that I posted, uh, Rosie died and she died very unexpectedly. It was, um, it was, it's just been a very, very, very hard few days. And today I'm finally able to focus on some of the positive and, and not get sucked into the, the negative and the regret and the what could we have done differently and you know why didn't we hold her every second and everything else. Sit down. Stay. 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 Shake. No, sit. So Rosie died Saturday morning, uh, June 5th, uh, just uh, four short days ago and I don't really want to talk about the details much because it's it just it's too painful to really do that and my wife covered it a little bit and, and, and some nice words that she wrote and we'll include those later in the video too uh, and, and a little bit about what she really meant to us but you know if I seem uninspired at times in videos in the coming weeks or months or in emails or even on the phone then um, I hope you can understand why that is you know you know, so we loved Rosie and we appreciated her so much. And I can't tell you how many times we told her that. You know, sometimes I wondered between her wanting to be pet and us wanting to pet her, how she had any hair left on her head. We just loved her so much. But one thing I can tell you is, is no amount of love, no amount of trying, no amount of praying, no amount of money can save your sweet doggy if it's time to go. We gave her everything we had, and I can promise you that. If there was ever an example that proved life is not fair, then this was it. I didn't need a reminder of that, but I got one anyways. And this isn't a dog channel by any means, but one of my favorite parts about making videos was any time I could include a little sneak peek or a cameo appearance of Rosie, and those were always my favorite moments to go back and watch when we were reviewing the videos. So the one last thing I, I could think to do for my Rosie was to make this memorial video of her and share our memories of her life that was cut way too short. And I'd appreciate it if you would take a few minutes of your time to just remember those with us and watch her grow from just a puppy just a couple short years ago into the full grown girl that she was now. And these pictures and videos are gonna show many different parts of her personality but they don't even begin to show how much we loved her and how she was woven into our lives every day. You know what's funny is Rosie's AKC name was Lady of Leisure and she did her best to live up to that name. She could take a nap on command and she always had a knack for finding the most comfortable spot in the house. And that could be on our bed or maybe it was laying right next to the windowsill and looking outside to see what was going on. Her big old dog bed or in front of the fireplace where she loved to lay in the wintertime. So I want to thank you so much for bringing up Rosie when you would reach out over the years, whether it's in a video or an email or a phone call and just asking how she's doing or just telling us you enjoyed seeing her or wondering what kind of dog breed she was. I thought there was going to be hundreds more videos in the future with her, but I'm sure thankful for the time that we had. For anyone curious or maybe looking for a dog, Rosie was a field spaniel. They're in the spaniel family, one of the larger breeds, bigger than a cocker spaniel. And obviously they look a little different in their coloring too. But I remember just researching like crazy, my wife and I just a, a few short years ago trying to find the right dog for us. <clears throat> one that wasn't too energetic, you know, one that would love to play but love to lay around and one that loved their family and was really good with kids. And, and Rosie just checked all those boxes, the field spaniel did. Rosie, what do you think about this snow? You really like it? Yeah. That's good snow, isn't it? Hey, Dad, you're so yummy. Yeah. And I can remember when we found a breeder nearby and then anxiously waiting until those puppies were ready to be brought home. And, and we were just so excited. I still remember that drive home with her. And we found our perfect dog in Rosie. And even knowing the way things turned out, I wouldn't have changed a thing. Yeah, 
Whoa. Ooh, snagged it. No. So thanks again to everybody who has sent their condolences and I know I'm not the only one that's ever gone through this and you know to those of you that are going through this at some point too, I mean it was a very, very dark few days where all I could do is dwell on the the horribleness of just her final days and I'm finally getting to the point where I can reach and, and you will too. Just remembering those good times and and the way she was when she was healthy. So may Rosie rest in peace here in the backyard, just some place that she enjoyed to be and some place we can look out on her and Lord willing, I'll see her again someday. going on here? Here, go ahead and hold the camera. You doing okay? Are you stuck? Back up a little bit. Yeah. 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 Alright, come here.
Thank you.